What's up guys, Stellar Scrooges here, back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing a long requested video, which is a 2022 lacrosse gear bag video for this season. Gonna go through it real quick with you guys. I know you guys really wanted to see this video this year, so instead of doing it with my gear bag, I just figured I'd do it in my locker so I could just show you guys everything and just go through what I use this year. So if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and also be sure to check out the Last Ride merch that just dropped. Make sure to go pick something up if you like it. Let's hop into the video. So we're gonna start from the bottom up. I'll start with our shoes and cleats. So to start, these are our lifting shoes. They are the Nike Metcons. These are the black and blue version. Super nice, good for lifting, very flat on the bottom, so they're good for squatting but nothing crazy with these. Like the colorway a lot though, no complaints there. Next up, we got some cleats. So I don't really wear cleats, I usually wear turfs because I tore my ACL in the past and it's just a little bit easier on my knees. But for cleats, I have these from last year. They are the Nike Hirachis, I think. I don't know, I think there's some type of Nike Hirachi cleat. These are probably my favorite ones out of all the Nike lacrosse cleats just because they look the nicest, super clean. These got some wear and tear in them, but yeah, that's what we got for cleats. Next up, we got my turf shoes. So these are what I normally wear every day for practice and on game day. They are just the Nike Hirachi 7 turfs. I've been using these for about a year or two now, so just got a new pair of them this year, but they're already kind of getting broken in. Definitely like wearing these and definitely recommend if you guys need a nice turf shoe. All right, so for shoulder pads this year, we got the new Maverick M5 liners. These are the Noxa required version of the new shoulder pads from Maverick. So they got the heart protector on here, super lightweight. They're pretty minimal design. This does kind of stick out a little bit, which is tough. It's really like uncomfortable sometimes, but it is extra protection for a reason. Yeah, and the liner version is not too bad. There's not like big cuffs on the top. So they are pretty slim for an extra protective pair of shoulder pads. So that's what we've been using this year. Next up, we'll go with the arm pads. So these are a new pair of arm pads that we got. I don't use these ones specifically just because I have another pair that I use, but these are the Maverick Max arm guards. They're custom to Villanova. They're super protective, very big, and they kind of cover most of your arm. So definitely good to have that as an attackman. But as I said, I'm using another pair this year, which are the new Maverick M5 arm pads. These I got from lax.com, so shout out to them. If you guys need to pick up any lacrosse gear, make sure to go check out their website. They have everything you need. Shout out to them for sending these over to try out this year. I've been loving these. They're super comfortable, very minimal, all white, but they have like a whole sleeve on here that's very comfortable that just goes right over your arm. Very protective while being kind of a minimal arm pad. These are kind of my go-to arm pads right now. Definitely recommend if you need a new pair. So these are what I've been using for my arm pads. Next up, we got some gloves. So these are kind of an older pair. These are the old Maverick Maxes that I used last year. Definitely still in great shape. No issues there. I still kind of use these as far as like practice and stuff. Definitely super comfortable, protective as well. Yeah, definitely a trusty old pair of gloves. Maverick Maxes are definitely a great option. These are a new pair of Maverick Max gloves. They're white with a little bit of blue on there. Again, custom to Villanova. Got the 41 and the logo on there. Definitely got to break these in soon because those are getting a little crusty. Yeah, love these so far. They're super broken in right away out of the package. Definitely excited to kind of break these in once I get the chance. Next, I just got another pair that I wanted to show you guys because Lax.com has just been killing it this year and they sent over another pair of Maverick M5 gloves. These I've actually never used before, but these are just an all white version. They're super clean, very, very comfortable, very broken in. Actually, probably more broken in than the Maverick Maxes, but they got kind of like a suede slash mesh palm, so I feel like you definitely can feel the stick pretty well with these. Probably be saving these for when I'm done with school and kind of need a new pair of gloves to break in, but these are definitely a great option if you're looking for a new pair. All right, working our way up, now we got the helmets. I'm gonna start with the Cascade S. This was our helmet last year. We just kind of carried it over to this year. We unfortunately only got one new helmet this year, which I'll we'll get to in a second, but this was definitely a great option last year and we kind of have it this year just in case we need a backup. Got some cool decals up top, Villanova on the back, and the Wildcat logo on the side. That was just kind of a backup helmet, but 
I'll get into this year's helmet right now. This year we got the new Cascade XRS helmet. This is the newest helmet from Cascade. Got the navy version with some cool decals on there, as you can see. Got nice stripes down the top, the Villanova V on the side, Villanova on the back with my number. Just a super sleek looking helmet. I think it really clean this year. Definitely nothing crazy. I think simple is better, but definitely an upgrade from the S. It's super comfortable, very protective. Kind of got some enhanced vision there. A little bit sharper of an angle of this back tail here. Yeah, just an updated design. Really like this one. I think we got a really solid helmet this year. Hopefully you guys like it too. Make sure to leave a comment down below what you think. Yeah, that's this year's helmet. All right, so now moving on to my sticks. We'll start with kind of a third backup here. Kind of have a bunch now, especially being in college over couple of years you kind of save up sticks but this one actually was again sent to me by lax.com it's kind of a custom strung up villanova themed maverick tactic 2 kind of a nice mid pocket there uh definitely love the colorway and they put that on a black maverick union yeah just overall super nice backup stick then we got kind of another backup stick basically the same setup as that one all white maverick tactic 2 strung up with shrinking 4x mesh two straights and a nylon again. This one's on an SCX Surgeon side tie, just for the meantime. Technically we have to use Maverick shafts, but just had this one laying around to throw the stick on. But yeah, that's just kind of another backup stick. Nothing crazy, basically the same thing. Moving on to my gamer. Got my game stick. This guy has been taking a beating lately. Once again, same setup. Got an all white Tactic 2 on here with ECD Hero 3 mesh, two straights and a nylon, kind of a baggy pocket right there. And I recently just threw it on a new Maverick Union. This thing's like the new white version, um, taped up halfway with a small butt end at the bottom. Really clean, super nice, very lightweight, but overall just a great game stick, super reliable. That's what I got for my sticks. Lastly, I'm just gonna kind of go over some of the apparel that we got. Nothing crazy, I'll just go through a couple stuff, but I know you guys like seeing that as well. To start, I'll show you guys our penny. This is just kind of a simple penny that we've had kind of last year and this year. Nothing crazy with that. Then I got some other apparel right here. Just got a little Villanova hat, super simple. Wear this on like away trips and stuff. Got a really nice long sleeve here. Really good quality, Nike. Got the number on the side here. That's just something that I kind of wear when it's a little bit colder out. And even just to kind of lounge around in. Got a Wildcats lacrosse shirt in gray. Again, Nike, just kind of dry fit style. And then lastly, I'm just gonna show you guys the hoodie we got this year. This is like the new Nike hoodie. Kind of that athletic style. Got these like things on the shoulders here. Again, kind of dry fit. That's kind of the sweatshirt we got this year. So it's just kind of bunch of the stuff in my locker just got a mouthpiece and stuff like that some tape yeah that's basically it for this year's gear bag i hope you guys enjoyed watching this is kind of my last and final gear bag for my college career so that's kind of weird but i know you guys like these videos so i wanted to make sure i made it this year for you hopefully you guys enjoyed watching let me know down below what your favorite piece of gear was my personal favorite is our helmet this year that we got. That's basically it for today's video. Again, if you guys want to pick up some merch, head down below in the description, follow that link, and go get yourself some stuff. But other than that, that's basically it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Peace.